Hi, I'm Kara. I'm the owner of Darling Vulgarity. We are a small retail brand focusing on slow, secondhand, and vintage fashion. We also do styling and creative directing. For our first YouTube series, I'm going to focus on a brand that I really love. It really made me fall back in love with fashion after having a baby and not feeling very good about myself. I hope to one day be able to sell Selkie on my retail site. For now, I am just a Selkie fan. So I'm gonna show you a few of my dresses. I'll do a quick review and then I'll offer some styling ideas. Let's get started. This first dress is new to me. It is the Yorkshire print in the Romantics style. I think this is a beautiful dress. It's cotton. I bought it secondhand off of a Facebook group. I traded it for a dress that did not fit me. Um, I really had my eye on this one. I was coveting it. And when it came up for a trade, I jumped at the chance. This is an extra, extra large. And you can see it fits nice and comfortably. Often my problem with the longer selkies is that I'm only five foot four, so I end up needing to get them hemmed. Uh, with this one, it has the drawstrings. So if I put the drawstrings down and let the dress fall straight, it probably would be too long. But since I can cinch these up, I think it adds a really nice bustled effect that I think is very pretty. Um, and it also makes it so that I don't need to have the dress hemmed at five foot four, I'm wearing some heeled sandals and it, uh, the length is perfect. I apologize that it's a bit wrinkled, but I just want to give you a close up of the Yorkshire print. As far as styling this one, I really love the idea of playing up the pastoral romanticism of the print and the design with a nice crocheted shawl. You could also substitute a crochet jacket. I forgot to mention this dress can also be uh, worn off or on the shoulders. In both cases, it is super cute. And if you wanna go a little bit more boho with it, you can add a really nice jewel toned hat. This one's from Anthropology. Not that you should ever feel the need to tone down a Selkie dress because they are gorgeous, but if you have the desire to tone it down to make it just a little more everyday wearable, I think also a jacket in a nice natural fiber makes a great uh, layering option for a Selkie dress. So over the Romantics, I've got this corduroy trench coat. A vintage denim jacket works great too. And if you're not trying to dress it down and you really want to pull out all the stops and romance it up, I cannot recommend Selkie corsets enough. They pull you in just the right way so that they're comfortable, but they add a lot of shape. This is the Duchess corset and the color is Sparrow, which goes perfectly with the Yorkshire color scheme. Selkie recently had their surprise bag sale. And so I ordered some surprise bags. I've never been a super girly girl, like never, pink ruffles everything. I'm on the East Coast, so it took a while for my bag to arrive. So I was checking the Selkie groups that I'm a member of, and a lot of people were getting their surprise bags already, and so I was really excited to see what was inside. And I saw a lot of people getting the Marie style in the Parfait Poet color. This is not a dress that I ever thought I would buy. It is frilly and pink. There's bows everywhere. It just seemed way too over the top feminine for me. But I started seeing it come up in people's surprise bags and I realized that I was hoping it would be in mine. And it wasn't. <laughs> I did another trade with someone who got the Parfait Poet Marie dress. And now I am tasked with how do I wear this? So as you can see, it's a lovely dress. It opens to a split in front. It has multiple layers underneath of the top layer of cotton. There are two layers of poly organza to add fullness to the skirt. The draping is attached to the skirt, but only way, way in the back. It has a lovely floral print. But as you can see, lots of ruffles, Lots of bows, lots of pink. <laughs> 
since I need my fashion balance, I decided to goth up my Marie Parfait Poet a bit. So as you can see, I added a secondhand black denim jacket that I had sewn this pretty cool tarot card patch onto the back of. And then I think a top hat and some heeled lace up Victorian style boots. And maybe you just wanna make the dress a little bit more casual so you can wear it out with friends. Selkie has all of these really super comfortable pullovers. This is one of their older styles, but they have new ones coming out all the time. The sizing is very generous, so you can always size down. I would just do it with a messy ponytail.